Hello everyone, this is Madhavi, working as an assistant professor in chemistry from Wichendas department in Wits College. Welcome to Wits Connect. Okay. Then this is the last first uh, first unit is the fundamental of chemistry. Okay. This fundamental of chemistry is uh, again three chapters. Okay. Atomic structure, uh, chemical bond, and oxidation and reduction. Okay. Atomic structure is the Bohr's theory, atomic number, mass number, Abbe principle, Powell's rule. Okay, and orbital, shape of orbitals. Okay, that's enough in the atomic structure. And next one is a chemical bond, ionic bond, covalent bond, coordinate covalent bond, and oxidation and reductions. Oxidation, what is oxidation, reduction, oxidation number calculations. Okay, this that is a first unit syllabus. Okay, next is second one, second unit is a very very important the solutions and collides. Second unit is a solutions and collides. Okay, these solutions. What is solution? Okay, definition of the solution. A homogeneous mixture of two or more, two or more substance at a molecular or ionic level is called solution. Okay, a homogeneous mixture. For example, milk in water, alcohol in water. Okay, salt in water, sugar in water. Okay, this is the homogeneous mixture of two or more. Substance in a molecular level and ionic level is called solutions. Okay, these solutions is a then the a solution containing only two components. A solution containing only two components. Okay, these two components is called binary solution. Okay, the two components, these two components is solute and solvent. Okay. This is the solute and solvent. Okay, solute is a a component present in less quantity in a binary solution is called solute. Less quantity, small quantity. Okay, and this is the solute. Okay, and solvent. This solvent is a component present in more quantity in a binary solution is called solvent. For example. This is the five grams of salt in hundred ml of water. Okay, five grams of salt in hundred ml of water. Okay, this is a for example five grams of salt in hundred ml of water. Okay, these five grams of salt. This is a five grams of salt is a less quantity. Okay, hundred ml of water. This is a more quantity. This is a what is the solute and what is the solvent. This is a solute is a five grams is a uh, salt is a solute. Salt is solute and water is solvent. Okay, this is the five grams of less quantity and hundred ml of water. Okay. 5 grams of salt is in 100 ml of water in dissolve the solution okay this is the less quantity is the salt and more quantity is a solute more quantity is a solvent okay and next another example is a 20% of alcohol in water okay is a water for example 100% of water is a 80% is water and 20% in Alcohol. Alcohol is twenty percent of alcohol is solute, and water is a eighty percent. It's a more quantity. Okay, this is the solvent. Okay, the solution definition is the homogeneous mixture of two or more substance in molecular level or ionic level is called solution. These two components is called the binary com solutions. These two components is the solute and the solvent. The solute means the less quantity of the component present in less quantity is called solute, and the component present in more quantity is called solvent. Okay, and next one is the classification of the solution based on the physical state. Okay, the based on the physical state in classifications. Okay, this is a very very important. Then this based on the physical state is a three three types. First one is the gaseous solutions. Second one is the liquid solutions and third one is the solids. Okay, these are three states. Okay, these gaseous solutions is in this solution gas is solvent and 
the solid may be solid state or liquid state or gaseous state okay this is the in this gaseous solution is the more quantity the more quantity is the gaseous state and less quantity may be solid or liquid or gas for example this are these these are again three types okay gas in gas okay these gas in gas this is a gas also this is the more quantity this is the solvent okay this gas in gas for example hydrogen and oxygen mixture in air okay this is a air is a solvent and the hydrogen and oxygen is a solid okay and next example is the liquid in gas okay this liquid in gas this the gas is the solvent liquid is the solid okay the so for example water in air okay this is the liquid in gas okay and soda water also and next one is third one is the solid in gas okay this solid in gas is the for example camphor in air or smoke okay this is the solid in gas okay next second type is a liquid solution okay this physical state in the liquid solution in this solution liquid is solvent it may solute may be solid or gas or liquid okay this is also liquid solutions is the liquid solution is solvent solvent may solvent means the more quantity in a component is called solvent this is the liquid solution is solvent okay solute may be solid or gas or liquid these are again three types first one is a gas and liquid okay this gas and liquid is a gas is the solute liquid is a solvent okay this is a soda water or carbon dioxide in water okay and next one second one is the liquid in liquid okay this liquid in liquid is example in this is also liquid in liquid this is alcohol in water and milk in water this is also alcohol in water and milk in water also this alcohol is solid and water is solvent this is a liquid state this is also liquid state okay and last one is a solid in liquid okay this solid in liquid is also same salt in water or sugar in water this is the examples okay last one is a solid solutions okay then same this solid solution in this solution is solid is a solvent it may be solute may be solid or gas or liquid okay same this is a solid is the solvent okay for example these are again three types gas in solid liquid in solid and solid in solid okay then gas in solid is the solid is the solvent gas is a solute okay liquid in solid this solid is a solvent Liqu liquid is a solute and solid in solid this is a solute this is solvent for example gas in solid is example in the hydrogen and palladium hydrogen and palladium hydrogen gas and palladium okay this is the example okay hydrogen is a solute and palladium is a solvent okay and next one is a liquid in solid okay liquid in solid is the mercury in zinc mercury in zinc this is the liquid in solid and next one is solid in solid this solid in solid is the alloys what is mean by alloys two or more metals with same property is called the alloys two or more metals in same properties is called the alloys this is for example zinc in copper okay these are the classification of the solutions solid state liquid state gaseous state okay next one is a based on the relative solute amount of the solute is a the solution classified is again three types based on the amount of solute okay this is the solute based on the relative amount of solute is a solution is again three types first one is a saturation solution second one is a unsaturation solution third one is a super saturated solutions okay this uh, saturated solution okay then the solution containing maximum amount of solute okay a solution containing maximum amount of the sol uh, ma maximum amount of the dissolved solute at given temperature is called saturation okay maximum amount of the solute okay it is the little amount of the dissolved in solute is called 
saturation okay example is the carbonated water soda water okay this is a saturation okay this a solution containing maximum amount of the solute dissolved in solute at given temperature is called saturation this is a carbonated water or soda water okay and the next one is a unsaturated solutions okay this unsaturation solution is a solution in which amount of the dissolved solute is less than less than the required for saturation less than amount of the required in for saturation in required for the saturation is called unsaturated for example salt in water okay salt in water and the next one is uh, alcohol in water unsaturated okay this unsaturated is the less amount of the amount of solute dissolved solute is less than required for saturation at given temperature is called unsaturated solution okay and the next one is the last one is a super saturated solution okay this super saturated solution is a solution containing is more amount of the solute okay more amount of the solute required for saturation at given temperature is called super saturation for example sugar syrup okay then this is a saturated unsaturated super saturated saturated means a solution containing which is a more maximum amount of okay maximum amount of dissolved in solute is called a saturation solution this is a carbonated water or soda water okay drinkings okay and next one is unsaturated unsaturated means this is a saturation is the less than amount of the solute it required for the based on the amount of the solute okay these again three types saturation unsaturation super saturation unsaturation means the less than required for the solution less than required for the solution is un unsaturated and more than amount of the solute is called the super saturated this is the example is sugar syrup okay first one is a saturation example is carbonate water second one is unsaturated solution is a example is uh, salt in water and next last one is a super saturated is the sugar syrup